So, um, Paul, let's zoom in on this car. We'll take some pictures while we go round. Right. Tell me why you um, why you chose a Yaris GR. I used to race. I've had some very exotic cars, and quite fancied one of these. I've had loads and loads and loads of Yaris's, but this is the first GR, and. Um, and it's just such fun. And I say to everybody, every pensioner should have one. Yeah, definitely, definitely. <laughs> so you rate this car uh, compared to the, the sort of more uh, serious track day tools, should we yeah, say, like Porsches yeah. and things like that that are out here with us today? It's, it's my daily driver too, but um, yeah, I'm still reasonably quick and um, there's still a fair bit of hooligan left in me. Yeah, so, yeah that's why um, I like it. We've done a few things to it to make it a bit quicker on the track done the suspension and upgraded the engine a little bit um, and it's just such fun. So what power are you running in this? About truck? 375. And um, just give a shout out to who tuned it for you. Sorry. Who was it that tuned it? Who mapped it? Well, uh, JF um, Automotive. JF Automotive yeah. out of Maidstone, yeah? Yes, yeah. And, uh, and did a very good job. Awesome, awesome. Tell me a little bit Tell me a little bit about the engine. Let's go have a look sure. at the engine. We'll give everyone yeah. a bit of a shot. Um, we've got Kelford cams and, um, and valve springs, um, a world speed inlet manifold, different intake, um, decatted down pipe, but that's it. Um, and that with mapping has given us about a hundred brake horsepower more than stock. That's awesome, isn't it? So yeah, I can see you've done a, quite a bit to the to the engine there. Yes. Although not that much, really surprisingly, for what you've actually got, is it? So right. and we're still running standard ECU, and um, and that's been a big saving. And that's uh, watching you go around track. That's um, yeah, that's a testament again to to JF because that's, that's true. She was uh, she hasn't missed a beat, and I've seen you do you know quite a few flying laps we, we see an edit where we uh, saw you come in with your brakes steaming away there so you clearly uh was taking everyone out on the track there i'm really well, we have a lot of car fun. so what uh, what have you done to the to the bodywork um not not the bodywork as in the modification but what, what about your suspension and stuff like that well, we've got obviously changed them. suspension on it and um strap braces everywhere um running running sticky tires and um and adjustable suspension, which really does make a difference. Yeah, yeah you've got um, a lot of, you can see you've got a lot of um, camber and cast yeah, on there, a bit of cast yeah. on there, kind of. So, yes. and um, some strut braces and various bits and pieces. Things to stiffen um, it up. And yeah, that's right, and DNA bits and pieces too. So, yeah, no, that's yeah. awesome, that's awesome. Well, uh, let's have a quick walk around. Thank you, John. I just think it's a, a wicked little car. Um, I've not done a video before, so it's going to be a little bit Good. rough around the edges, but, All right, um, but that's what makes it fun. And then we'll go, we'll and then, go, uh, go yeah, for we'll a few strap, laps. We'll strap this in uh, with you and Tony, or, or like myself, All and right. you can uh, come and scare me, no doubt. Let's